Hi, good morning. How are you doing? This is Thorn Holder from Dream Development and Designs. I'm here with my twin boys, Zachary and Xavier, about 17 months, years, uh, months old, and they're having a good time. A little bit bored, I'm sure, but we leave the house just now and go off into the world and discover many things and interact with people and make them smile. One thing I want to say to you today, it's going to be a very short video. Um, training the mind. Get rid of old habits and put new ones in. That's very important. The mind likes repetition. That's how it works. That's how habits are formed through repetition. You have to put it into your subconscious uh, by doing it over and over. This is very important. It's very easy because all you have to do is do it once today or twice. It's easy to do some twice. You take your clothes off or you change your clothes to go to bed or to go out and, and you do it twice, right? It's easy. You put one pint of echo and you do it twice. You brush teeth in the morning, you brush teeth in the night. You do it twice. So just like that, you can institute programs that can help you gain the habits that you need. One of the most important things to gain control of is your mind. So as far as habits, <laughs> what I think you should address first is, your, is how you think. Because your thoughts control your actions, basically, as you think, as a man think it, so he is, you know. Um, think and grow rich and all these type of philosophies that came about with the understanding that, hey, your mind basically governs your actions and the stuff that is around you. So the first thing that I would admonish, admonish you to do is clean that thought process up. Start looking at the world in a new way so you can start creating and projecting yourself, okay? One, one of the things that's very easy to do to start gaining a positive mental attitude and a good habit and a good outlook on life is start writing things down that you enjoy. Start writing things down that you are grateful for. You would see immediately after approximately 16 to 21 days that your thoughts are changing. As you continue looking at the different things, putting certain information into your mind, your mind will start to develop according to the information that you're putting in it. Okay? What happens to most people, they are not very watchful. They allow the telly, their neighbors, their family, the church, the school, and their friends to dictate what they want to do. And that's not living. You are dead. If you are doing things that other people have told you uh, you're supposed to do, you are no longer alive. You are dead. You like, you like, you like lifestyle. Okay? A cow in this country, in India, is a bit different. But a cow, if a cow walks by, well, you, I live, where I live, there's no cows nearby, but if a cow's dead, then get it off the road, you know, clean this cow, get this cow from the road. Human is a bit different, okay? We are not like that stuff. We have a certain level of consciousness and intelligence, it's a bit different from animals, okay? Animals have group consciousness, and groups of animals operate the same way. Humans have independent consciousness, where um, we can choose to operate a particular way um, and the choices that we've made is to operate in a very low vibration, very negative. So immediately start those habits, start writing down the things that you're grateful for, morning and evening as you get up, write your goals down, write the things you're grateful for, get enthusiastic, get going with your purpose. As you end your day, realize that you've achieved your goals that you had set out, plan some new goals for the next day, write the things that you are grateful for. It's also important to reflect upon the things that you have learned. And if you could articulate those things into words, write those down as well. Those things will definitely help you develop and become a perfect person. We are all perfect already, but we still have desires that we want to achieve. The perfection I'm talking about is developing the strategy to go ahead and acquire these desires. Remember, eyes on the prize, stop putting shit on.